Hey guys, it's Nick here with Cunis RV coming at you another product spotlight. Trailer that we're looking at today is a 2022 Jayco Whitehawk 29BH. So what this trailer is, the Jayco Whitehawk has been around for a while now, but this is gonna be Jayco's luxury lightweight unit. Uh, this thing comes in at roughly right around 7,000 pounds, a little over 35 feet long in total length, can sleep up to 10 people. Uh, what makes this trailer ideal is, uh, is it's a full fiberglass sided unit full fiberglass and it comes packed with a ton of features. You'll see on the front of this unit right here, we got two 30 pound LP tanks versus 20 pounders. They do this huge, nice windshield on the front of this too. Uh, that is awesome for natural daylight coming in. Depending on where you parked at the campsite, you can look out the front of the unit or if you got it, you know, back up to a lake or anything. Um, that makes a big difference there. The, uh, they run really nice LEDs. They run nice amber LEDs here, nice blue ones on the front. And uh, some of the stuff that makes it what it is, is the lightweight, it all starts with the frame. So the frame on this is called the Norco Next Gen Frame. Uh, th they go for a lot of less welding on the unit, so you don't get a no bad days welding. What that's gonna be is you get someone at the factory, they're not having a good day, they don't throw as much weld down as they should have, that can sometimes be a compromise on that. This uses what's called huck bolts. Uh, what that's gonna be is they're like these big bolts that go right through the frame, suck everything a lot tighter, and uh, everything is gonna be a lot more precise on this unit, especially when you go down the road too. Everything stays straighter, everything's a lot more true in the tolerance that way. Uh, as we go down the side of the unit, you'll see these huge slam, slam latch doors with metal latches versus the plastic ones. Nice magnets, huge storage going all the way through. This is also going to be a two door unit. You got one door going to the bedroom and you also got one door going to the back area. The uh, axles on this are going to be a widespread axle. That's awesome for going down the road. Everything stays a lot straighter, helps take that tongue weight too and kind of balance everything out. They run nicer aluminum wheels on these units paired with uh, Goodyear tires. So they do, it's a one year, no questions asked, but they have a total of a five year warranty on them. Going down the side here too, these use a nice more ride step above steps on the main entrance door. These just fold right inside the door. Nice solid piece when you get in, you don't feel the trailer flex or anything. That guy does that, paired with a big fold and grab handle as well, which is awesome. Taking a look at the outside kitchen on this thing too. You got a sink, comes with a outside fridge, and then this right here, it's called the J-Port, and what that's gonna be for is that is paired to a griddle. So this unit here actually comes with a full-blown griddle that goes in, would sit right here, and that has been a huge piece that they've been doing for the last year or so. So that is awesome because now, instead of having just a little two-burner stove, the griddles have taken off in the home industry. Everybody loves it. You can use it for cooking anything, and uh, they've been really great. So taking a look at some of the outside features we got on the back too, uh, pack and play door. This is awesome. Full door opens up, takes you right to your bunks. Top bunk here actually folds right up. You're able to throw coolers in here, bikes, whatever you want. It actually has its own tie down pieces in here as well. Paired to a ladder and actually has a backup camera prep on this thing too. Let's take a look inside and take a look at what the 29BH is all about. So here we are standing at the entrance of the 29BH. Uh, you'll see two huge double bunks that they run on this thing. And Jayco's bunks are not just the strongest, they're almost double the actual capacity of the other guys that are out there. So these right here are over 600 pounds on the bunk beds where a lot of guys are 250 to 300 pounds. You'll see on the inside too, this thing has a full fantastic fan, not just a little guy, it's actually got the full blown big fan. Everyone seems to love that. Paired with a kitchen skylight as well. You get a lot of natural light on the inside. You'll see the wood and everything that they run. This is called like a modern farmhouse interior. The nicer white wood, but it's paired with a lot of uh, nice black contrast. You know, you feel like you don't just walk into a full blown white room, but it gives it a really awesome homey feel on the inside. Uh, looking at the bathroom on this thing too, it's one of the biggest bathrooms I think in the industry. They use a full blown uh, soft clothes, foot flush porcelain toilet, huge shower pan on the inside of there as well. Uh, this thing also has a nice big vanity and a vanity mirror that they run. 
So taking a look at the kitchen on this unit, you'll see on the end of the countertop, they got a leaf. We have a full blown stainless steel sink, which is easy cleaning and easy maintenance. Uh, they do a nice cutting board also with a stainless steel drying rack that comes right over the top here, pull out sink sprayer. And what's really cool is where the outlets are on this unit. So with this guy here, we can take this, pop that up. We got two 110 outlets and two 12 volt USB outlets. Awesome for charging or throwing a, a coffee pot on here. Three burner stove top with an oven and a glass top here gives it a nice decorative feel. The uh, refrigerator on this unit as well is going to be a 12 volt refrigerator. It's an eight cubic foot and this thing gives you a lot of space. You'll see compared to the older gas electric units where they used to have the old compressor and everything back there. This thing has made a big difference. So looking at the seating on the unit, you'll see a full blown U shaped dinette. And uh, I love that they have like the no knee knocker legs here. You don't see the two posts that go down. They got one piece here. You're not trying to slip in, hitting your knees or anything. Really awesome LED pendant lights. Even like the, the shades on this thing too. These are the nicer black pull down shades. Everyone seems to be loving those versus the metal ones or even like the older color uh, where they're almost like the pewter where it seemed like your finger oils would get attached to them. This thing here too, nice theater seating. And what's so great about this unit, you're, everywhere you look, everywhere you sit, you're right across from the TV. You don't have your neck turned all the time. You don't, you're not gonna get a stiff neck. You're not trying to, to, it's not gonna be an inconvenience. Something like this thing too, huge screen TV here paired with a, with a electric fireplace. That is awesome when you start getting to these late summer, you know, cold fall nights where uh, you want to turn that on and just get the chill out of the place that right there is awesome and that will definitely do the job so taking a look at the bedroom on this unit you'll see it's a full 60 by 80 real queen bed not the normal rv queen uh, really nice mattress that they run on these things comes with a nice quilting two shirt closets on each end what makes this unit so unique is the walk-in style closet that is killer so that's behind the entertainment center on this unit and uh, they definitely made a great use of space on this unit so there you have it guys, that's taking a quick look at the 2022 Jayco Whitehawk 29BH. If you like this video and wanna see more of them, we try to upload many weekly, hit that like and subscribe button below or take a look on our website at cunisrv.com. Roll that outro.